I think that you have to find, and I know it's cliche, but you have to find something bigger than you. When I say that, I don't mean intrinsically you're not a valuable human being. I just mean it's hard to be focused on self when you're focused on others. So that would be my natural reaction. When I felt the best was when I knew I was directly helping other people. This is the other thing too. You have to make sure you're helping people with scars, not open wounds, right? Uh -huh. So like, I would not Describe have Describe that a little more. <laughs> yeah, I've told my story, I don't know, thousands of times at this point. So for me, it's scarred over. I can talk about it. We can dig into all of it. I am not ashamed. I am not afraid. It doesn't trigger me in any way, shape, or form. Where if you asked me the day after I had those thoughts and said, hey, can we have a conversation about this? That was still an open wound. Mm -hmm. I would not have been able to talk about that without that doing something detrimental to me. So I believe, and one of our mentors, Evan Carmichael, said this, your purpose comes from your deepest pain. My purpose in life is really to try to help people from ever getting to the point I got to through self-improvement. But that required me to tap into that moment after I got through it and say, yeah, this is what I want to be in the world. So I think that you have to figure out what service would you like to bring to the world? I think that's something. And then I think growth helps. I really feel like a lot of us, when we feel stagnant, that's when you lose hope. When you lose hope, it's because you don't feel like you're making progress towards anything. And I think even in my story, I made all the progress I wanted and I felt like I was starting over and I didn't know what to do. I didn't know what to progress towards. So those are a couple of things I would say. I think another important thing is you've got to check the circle that you're surrounding yourself with. One of my favorite quotes in the world, are the people in your life the best from your past or the best for your future? Mm -hmm. I, I was very blessed because I had really positive people around me. That's one thing I've been very blessed with. But I can imagine if I had a negative group of people around me who I didn't trust and who were putting doubt into my fire, I don't know that things would have been the same for me. So that's another important thing is your community, whether you know it or not, your community is having a giant impact on you.